the beast inside. So here we are for the next part of the beast inside playthrough, which uh, the, in actuality I played it in one fell swoop over the course of five hours. Well, not the whole game, the first half of the game. But I broke it down into individual little videos so you can consume them, you know, at a more tolerable pace. This one is a bit longer than the last episode because it, there's just like a lot of story that happens in this part. And I don't know if that's the pace that it goes from there on because it's been a couple weeks since I played last. So the other ones might be just as long. If not, then they'll be shorter. You know, simple. Let's uh, pick up where we left off on The Beast Inside. Mom, is that you? Chapter 3. And that's the end of the notebook. Damn it, someone must have torn out the rest of the pages. What a riveting story. It's like I was actually there. Strange. I was in the attic and... I'll show the diary to Emma. She might find it interesting. Honey, you won't believe what I found it. Hey, Emma? Can you hear me? Emma? It's not gonna be Emma. I was calling you before, but you wouldn't even answer. I was Where possessed by a sub-notebook. I was snooping uh, around the was attic. In the, ether. the power is out, by the way. Well, no diary. shit. W what? A fuse must have blown. Bia, darling, go to the basement and fix it before it gets dark. Why don't you go down there? I don't know, know nothing work. about fuses. The sooner we start, the better. I don't have to tell you that, do I? Uh, I guess not. Uh, you, you sure you don't want to hear the notebook? Because it's pretty spooky. Here, let me get you some fresh air. <laughs> there you go. Now you can really feel the nature. What's her problem? She sounded like I took a piss on a mother flower bed. Power is out, by the way. I feel like I would need a flashlight to, to navigate my way through the basement. Am I right? Okay. Hey, wait a minute. I threw you on the roof. Well, looks like we're going to the breaker box uh, in the dark. I need a flashlight. Fucking send him. Oh, there we go. Thank God. Maybe I can find one in the attic. There's a lot of junk in there. Yes, there is a lot of junk indeed. Now, if I was a flashlight. Where would I be? You, know, you just had to read the journal. You couldn't have just left it alone and found out the hard way. Oh. Well, that's unfortunate because I threw that axe out the window. The killer will never find the axe on top of the roof. What the fuck kind of flashlight is this? Ah. <laughs> okay. It's daytime, nothing spooky, no ghosts come out in the daytime, you know? It's okay, I'm not afraid of ghosts anyways. There we go. He's gonna turn on, there's gonna be something there. Boo 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 boo! Do 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 Hey, there's another axe! For God's sake. Oh no! A horse! This horse will haunt me in my dreams. That's not the only thing that's gonna haunt you in your dreams throughout this journey, my guy. Yeah! Where are the fuses? The basement. Oh, wait a minute. This whole area is cemented off. Interesting. Ooh, a key. Do I not? Strange. One's missing. Did someone take it out on purpose? Maybe there's a spare fuse in the shed by the house. Spare fuse in the shed. Well, I know a lot about the shed. Let's go. Okay, oh, oh, here we go. Hell yeah. What's of a... Uh... Flammable barrels out here. We should just burn the whole house to the ground, honestly. Spooky hat man? Damn, there are no fuses here. Of course. of course. What the f. What is this? What did all the shirt covered in blood? It looks fresh. Oh, how did it get here? And an unfinished fizz can. How could they waste perfectly good soda? <sighs> Why would Emma bring my old stuff from the office here? Ooh, the quantum localizer. <laughs> it makes sense of it, but I trust that the author knew what he was writing about. 
<laughs> How goofy. Allows an in-depth analysis of kinetic energy preserved in so-called quantum traces, enabling the user to identify silhouettes of people or other living organisms whose past presence in a given fragment of space-time continuum have left behind have left behind detectable clusters of waves and particles, i.e. quantum clouds. Hmm, yes. Quantum science. Equipped with two ultra sensitive sensor ultra sensitive sensors sensitive sensors. The device can detect both electromagnetic and quantum traces. <clears throat> Physics. Well this isn't a fuse, but it is indeed a quantum localizer. Maybe I can Jesus! Emma, you scared the crap out of me. Okay, you can open the door. Yeah. Emma? Emma? Honey? Oh, oh, too early. That's gonna get me killed later on. Ooh, spooky! Was that, am I ever really there? Something's not right. Maybe the localizer will show me just what's happened here. Wait, what did they say in training? Huh, if I remember correctly, this prototype device can be used to detect traces of a person's presence from the past. All I need is to be in a strong field of quantum particles, and with a little bit of luck and science, I'll be able to see a silhouette of the person who was here in a different time. Of course, it was just that easy. The different person at a different time. I mean, it's kind of just that in your face about it, because I feel like the events of the past are going to directly affect the future with all this time anomaly. Bullcrap. Ooh. Scanning for quantum clouds. Hello, ghosts. Is anyone there? This is the place. Now I need to use the pulse to show the cloud. And I need to scan it. A signal. All covered in blood. Oh. I'll try to find more traces. Oh, I it see. Doesn't him. look good. I have to find out what happened here. Well, he looks like a dashing young gentleman, if I do say so myself, sir. From the great beyond. Mind telling me why there's so many broken TVs in this property? Ooh. Alright, alright. 360. 360. Bam! Got him. There's the anomaly. Now I have to charge the localizer and hit it with a beam. That should do it. Time to stabilize the cloud. Or is this like some dead livestock? Damn it! Closed. Just closed. It, it's a barn. You couldn't just, like, like bust one of those broken boards right there? Yeah, see? Easy. It looks like something or someone is hanging in there. Is that... <laughs> Fuck! This thing scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I'd better check what the localizers detected before I go in. Nah, man, that's a skinwalker back there if I ever seen one. Should be able to make our way around. Oh, it's moving. Gotcha, bitch. Who is he? What did he hide here? A hunting knife. Ah, uh, some dramatic it. irony. I'll take it. Very immersive. All right, time for another dramatic fall. <laughs> God, done this. This wasn't just some poacher. More like a fucking sadistic hunter. It's a skinwalker. Don't trust him. Wait, that beeping. It's as if it's coming from the inside. The animal is hung up on a rope. Maybe I can get up there and cut it down. Oh no, they planted a bomb on the elk! Alright, time to cut the rope. Really? You're not gonna put that? There we go, okay. Emma's gonna walk into the barn right as I'm fucking elbows deep in this deer carcass.
<laughs> oh, come on. You couldn't use, like, any of the tools you found to fucking dig around in there? It's gonna blow! Oh, this is sick. I think I'm gonna puke. Well, then why are you doing it? Just three little quick type things. The fuck is it? Is it the fuse? Wait, What's did they all put this the equipment? And why was it in? Fuck! What if the Soviets sent someone to follow us? Well, there's the, the fuse. Soviet. If this isn't a threat, then I don't know what is. At least I've got a goddamn fuse. Time to go to the basement and turn the power back on. Someone pulled it out. This. Someone's butchered a deer, and the evidence suggests that sick fuck has been in our house. That is so weird. Wait, what's this way? That is so weird. I am captivated by what's going on. But what's a haps is happening with the spooky barn? I remember Forest back people. in the day some twisted kids in the area played with the occult. I don't think this could have been them. Besides, the equipment that was inside it looked military grade. Clearly, the locals make new neighbors feel welcome. I just hope they don't mistake us for turkeys on Thanksgiving. What? Oh. oh. The tower's back on, I guess. Hmm, interesting. Or maybe it's no big deal. Maybe I've just been reading too much poll. Well, my job here is done. I better go back under Emma's thumb, considering her mood swing. It's only the third month. What's it going to be like by the ninth? Am I a, am I the spy? Boom! Jesus, woman! <laughs> ah, she's the hat, hat man. Deck. Cool, huh? Wonder if some magician used to live here. Sure, Harry fucking Houdini. Maybe he's never gotten out of that hat. Actually, where did you find it? I just read about one like this. Upstairs. Now watch carefully. If it's a rabbit, I want it for dinner and a stew. Ta-da! Clever. You think oh, you should coat the work for me with magic? Where do we start? Sometime later. Oh no. Box full of cash. Maybe you shouldn't write on your box full of cash that it's a box full of cash. Either way. Oh, do I really have to remind you what the doctor said? You've done it plenty of times already, but really, I don't have to sit idle all. Yeah. Still, in your condition. It's not critical. I'm just pregnant, remember? But fine. Pregnant. Here, have some water. <laughs> Wait. Sorry, sorry. Here, have some water. Uh, hold on. We're getting there. Have some water! Don't look at me like that. <laughs> Or are we hiding from if the kids? I can't KGB? help you. I'll pester you with questions. Have they called you from work yet? I'm the fastest yeah. painter on the planet. And did you give them our new number? Honey, it's the government. They even know the angle you're tilting your head at. <sighs> Gives me the creeps. Have you thought about doing something other than, you know, crypt analysis? I mean, before you joined the CIA? Maybe some like, cryptozoology. Like um, something that doesn't come with being responsible for millions of lives. Some job without all the spies, agents, and double agents lurking behind your back? Without the constant feeling that you can't trust anyone? Listen, oh, I can go find some weird. cryptids. Besides, I can trust you, right? She's the spy. Oh, that's what happens. They get what are you staring at? attacked by the spy, and then the ghost picture? decapitates the spy. Something behind it. I'm calling it. It looks like you you got it handled pretty well over there all by yourself. Oh no, a painting of the hat man! Oh god, now I regret putting that thing on my head. I wonder who that guy was. Yeah, he's pretty ugly. Maybe if we hang this in the bedroom, you'll come to us in our dreams and tell us everything. 
I'd hang you Ooh. first. Okay, okay. Sorry, buddy, you're going to the basement. That's the proper place for gentlemen from the previous wow. century. Yikes. A few days later. Ah. A few days? It was like a week ago. Right? I mean, we've been chilling then, I guess. No spooky, scary skeletons. Now that is one beautiful portrait of Jesus Christ himself on the wall. Hello? It's David. Oh, so, oh what's up, David? Boss. This is the moment when you start to rush me and I start to sweat. Well, I don't want to press you too much, but I haven't heard from you for a week now. So I thought, maybe yeah, he was looks killed good. by bears or wolves. I'd better call him. Because you're stuck in the middle of nowhere, right? <laughs> yeah, I'm stuck in every possible way. <sighs> you're not the only one. Three quarters of the team were assigned to work on the Russian woodpecker. And on top of that, Harold is... The Russian what? <laughs> Harold. The one who intercepted the telegrams. What happened? I don't know. Stress. He's been paranoid lately, seeing Soviets everywhere. Either he went nuts and did something stupid, or those Soviets did get him after all. Fuck the numbers, on Adam. On our soil? Well, they could be anywhere. <laughs> on our soil? I don't want to think our soil? I can't believe it. it the KGB, worse, those rat bastards. We don't make a <laughs> yes. in the next few weeks. I've got the documents from Janice with me. And I got a fucking <laughs> quantum nail as laser. And give my regards to your wife. I'll call you in a few days. See, the Soviets have one of those quantum doohickeys. There goes my vacation. The cipher machine is in the See? office. I've wasted yeah. enough time already. KGB ain't got nothing on this. Oh, this is gonna be another fucking oh, cipher. It's still warm. Oh no. I was not ready to be this kind of a code breaker. Open, Open the cover top. and place the cylinders. Easy. Trust no one but yourself. Sounds ominous. Who wrote this anyway? Yeah, who wrote it? Was it the KGB? It was probably no the KGB. One. Check combinations 29 and 30. Okay, here we go. Still nothing. Fuck. Ah, oh, thank God. Oh, anger issues open the drawer. Ho ho ho. This better not be another fucking cipher. This terrible crime shocked. Fuck. This looks like our house. The victim's throat was slashed. This is getting too fucked up. Seriously. Ooh. You didn't think to catch the fucking. How long has this been here? Is this blood? Or just looks rust? like a is this victim I think it is? throat slasher no, no, tool. Nicholas. Gotta take a sip of my G fuel. It hurts, so I must be alive. Damn it, I almost. Oh boy, here we go. Back to the spooky scary. Oh, okay, so I just. We're picking up where we left off. Get up, the hat man's still up there. Oh, he's gone. What is he doing in our house? Is he the one responsible for my father's disappearance? The hand of what justice! In the basement? No. I'd rather not think of whose blood that was. Oh, hey, look, the ghost got the door open for me. <sighs> ah! My head. You can't come in here! Hear me, you snot! You're not allowed here! The joke's on you, I'm an adult now, and I'm my own man. Ah! What's wrong with me? You are not alone. Yo, old cheapskate, man's life ain't worth nothing to you. I ain't asked you for no, for, for no five. Hundred dollar or thousand dollars. I just wanted a small sum, but you don't want to give me no dime after what happened to my husband who gave his life for your sake. I ain't leaving lit like that. You got my word. Maria. Oh, it's a chick's voice. 
Whoops. <laughs> uh, anyways. I mean, it is 1864. You are not alone. Well, thanks. I kind of figured that one out. Wait! I just came in through that door, right? What the hell? I need to find another exit. That's what I'm saying. Great. Now we go on some crazy ghost ex es escapade. Let's see if there's any, uh... There we go. That's what I was looking for. Any more extra kerosene or matches? Nope. Just some trousers. Ah, yes, the exit through the old broom closet. Why would they put this in the game? Yeah, let's just crawl on through. There's not gonna be no spooky scaries popping out in the crawl space. You couldn't have just fucking, like, I don't know, ripped the boards off the door? Music stop. Why did the music stop? Oh god, this is like straight out of one of my nightmares. Ah! Rats! Get away! <laughs> Maybe this is where I find the ferret before I stuff him. Oh no, wait. The ferret was in the flash. Oh, that's a person! Fight me! Fight me like a man! Yeah, that's right. You better run. You don't want a piece of me. Oh. God, let's well, not. Damn it. Yeah. Damn. I feel like this house is trying to kill me. Oh yeah, it's definitely the house for sure. Cost of the lives three miners. Witness claims the uh, tremors were felt up to half a mile from the mine, and the bang could be heard from inside the homes, even with the windows closed. Cause of the explosions, whether it could be avoided, is yet to be determined. Our reporter. Reporter has not been able to contact either of the mine's co-owners, George Whitehead. Ryan? Ryan, are these your ancestors? <laughs> Was unavailable while Jacob Hyde refused to comment on the accident. He will provide our readers with further details as the story unfolds. Ooh. <laughs> any, any ghost weapons in here? No? Maybe I can throw this baby at him. Eat baby, you specter. Yeah! Must be one of those ambulances supposed to bring wealth. My father wasn't superstitious, but when push came to shove, he would catch, clutch at straws. Rotate for hidden message. George Washington! Oh, George Whitehead. <laughs> yeah! Amulet attack. Ooh, hoo -hoo, now we're talking. Just in case. I'd rather not kill anyone. Nah, he's on your property. Help. What was that ammo? Oh, now it's locked. Time there. to go to the basement and see what's behind that door. Why would you not keep your ammo by your gun? Is my question. Maybe I just throw the gun at him. Oh well, no time like the present. Or past. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah. There we go. Haha! -ha! Stay back, guest. I have evolved to lockpicking skills. Any ammo? Maybe a Ouija board? Communicate with it? Time to get off my land. Who almost misses matches. Hello, Spectre? Stay back, I'm warning you. I have a gun. Did I say I need to go back to the basement? basement. Alright, fuck it. We're oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> I fucking fell down the stairs on that one. No, it can't be happening. Horse, did you see that? true. Why do they say I'm safe now if it's coming back? We'll just put you right right, right there. There we go. Now he won't be able to jump scare us again. Stay back, ghost. I will beat you with the fireplace scoop. hi -ya. Doors locked. Great, we have to squat our way through here again. 
scary fucking painting. That metal door, the one with the spooky handprint. But first, let me. I should be able to get into another room from here. <laughs> Pull! <laughs> Yes, let's go through the bloody planks. That could just be red paint. Pull! <laughs> Pull! What the fuck? There we go. Jeez. Really, we were walking just fine without sidling. Can't peek through the crack to see the ghosty boy. Stuck in the wall. Ooh, uh oh, some some lore breakdown. Get him, Batman! Oh shit! As a tidbit, angry. This the Hatman probably is real. his dad. With all the uh, anger issues shit, and abuse going on. Here. There must be another way. What? Oh, okay, we're just gonna do a little shimmy dance. <laughs> Woo! He found us! Jesus Christ, some dude just ripped you through the wall. I know you might be in pain, but I'd probably get up a bit faster than that. Oh, he left. Well, now we can open this. world did they get out if... Wait. There's a mechanism blocking the door. You're right. Seems like some parts are missing. That is very sus. This is real. The blood. The metal rod. These are no phantoms. I haven't lost my mind. Not this time. I don't know. It seemed kind of phantom to me. I mean, what else would it, it be used for? Looks oh. like one of those abominations. Oh, we're rolling in style. Was a judge that used to come to our house. What was Bro his name? Bro got the drip now. Norton. Wait a minute. Well, it is him. It Norton must have lost his the wig, desk so that it's was ours covered now. up in that newspaper. How is that possible? And the other man? The one in the hat. He locked up the judge. So maybe he did the same to my father. Nah, man. The man in the hat I'll is retrace your father. Steps. Maybe I can find out something about my father's disappearance. And, and be gone with the drip. Missing people. A crank. Maybe I could use it to open the door. Got that heary, oh, heary drip going How in the on. the world did he get away? The shape tells me I need to put the cards in the room. Okay, what was the point of that? Escape? The judge is bleeding heavily. He will look for help. True. Just follow the blood trail. I do have a gun with no ammo. Ah, oh, horse, how could you block the way? Blood trail. I can use it to track him down. What if I'm the guy with the hat? Oh, thank God, we're getting out of the cramped, spooky house. This I could do. Follow that blood trail! Oh yeah, rope bridge! Let's do it! Woo! Rope bridge! There. He'll go to the inn. I thought it had been closed many years ago. This game is way bigger than I could have imagined. There's a whole ass inn. Maybe I could use it. 
Oh, hey, bullets. Thank fucking God. Fuck yes, let's go. Ain't no hat man gonna get us now. He must have known. Who Stay he? Stay away. Don't come any closer. I have a gun. Don't make me do this. What the fuck was that? But he did not. Ah, a warning shot. He let him do it all. Yow! What? He's vanished into thin air. It's kind of anticlimactic. Oh, let's go! <laughs> Bullets only keep him away for a while. Okay, I guess they just kind of auto float towards you. Stay back, specters! I've got a gun. Everybody knows guns are super effective against ghosts. A slide cancel. Break your ankles. Useless. We will finally leave me alone. It's a long, long way to the hillside in. He left me for dead. I don't care. <laughs> you specter. Who needs a quantum analyzer when you have gun? Ah! Ah! No! <laughs> I missed! <laughs> GG, that's game. Fuck. <laughs> hey, my first death. It's getting faster. Bullets only keep him away for a while. I did not have, like, unlimited sprint. For once in a horror game. This is useless. Will he finally leave me alone? Ah, of course. What do you now. want? No! Oh, oh god! Get him! Get him! <laughs> Leave <laughs> me alone! <laughs> that was a close one. I want to go home. <sighs> oh, we're stacked on bullets. Far from here. I better check that place. Yeah, you better run. Boss fight. Look at all the people just watching from the end. Oh, it's getting intense now. Ready for play gun. Walking simulator of goddamn Resident Evil. What? I was outside of that attack. Ooh. Zombie rules, I just kick it in four times. Okay, I get that one to him. Those axes. 
small too. Ooh. Headshot, baby! Thank Cory for the raid. Thank you, I just noticed it. Wait! Oh, you fucked me up. I, was, I didn't know there was another thank phase. Thank Cory for the raid! Obviously, I'm gonna thank him, but Jesus Christ. He just ruined my second phase. Thank you, Cory, for the uh, lovely raid. Wish I caught it a bit or earlier, but I was fighting. Oh, I gotta set the whole boss fight over again. These people just watching me shoot this man wildly and did nothing to help. Oh, so now he's got fucking fire bending powers. Everything changed when the Fire Nation attacked. Oh, I had to reload. Goddamn. It's such an easy attack pattern. I keep fucking up. Well, throughout the whole first two and a half hours I was playing this game, I was not expecting it to ramp up like this. Ah! It gave me the impression that it was just going to be a walking simulator style horror game <laughs> for the first half. Justice achievement! <laughs> Whatever that means. Let's hide. Do I get any special rewards? Hey, where'd all the people go? Dang, the spectators really said the show's over and left. Alright, stay back, Spectres. I have a gun now. And I'd know how to use it. I heard them. No, it's happening again. It can't be. Ah, the PTSD. Oh, Jesus Christ, we killed you! <laughs> like father, like son, it is you that should have died then. Oh, it's the hat man. He saved me. Alright, uh, my theory of the hat man being the father still stands. Hit him with the two piece of the biscuit. Shield your eyes! <coughs> Alright, this game was worth the two dollars. It's pretty sweet. And that's gonna do it for this uh, this this portion. I was gonna say this week's, but it's been a couple weeks. I'm kind of like spacing my videos. I'm trying to alternate, you know, like airsoft, this, then this, then that, then airsoft. You know, trying to keep it fresh, keep it different, uh, unique. Every week, I might be doing two videos this week because I have a whole thing I wanted to talk about that's just goofy. Like and subscribe. The the beast inside. It was a long one. If you stuck through it, thank you guys. We'll see you next time.